Hello and welcome to our February 2022 market update. Hard to believe it's already been one month uh, of the year of 2022 is gone. So I'll jump right into it here. We're going to talk about three things. One, of course, the usual, the market statistics. Two, what's happening with interest rates right now. And the third thing I want to talk about is, boy, gosh, how do we deal with this situation we're experiencing? Ultra low inventory, very few homes available. So the market statistics, our inventory, the saga continues, is way down. So in the end of January this year, 1st of February, we had 132 homes on the market. That compares to over 238 last year. Okay, so we have 44% fewer homes for sale right now than a year ago. And last year, a year ago, was a record low inventory. So you've been hearing me say this, it's gotten more extreme. Our pending sales down a little bit, about 153 versus 100 more last year. So about a 40% drop, but that would be expected because there's fewer homes available. And then we have our closed sales again, about 153 this year, down from about 201 last year, probably an inventory problem. Finally, again, the scary one with the inventory, 66 new homes came up for sale in the month of January versus last year, about uh, 100. And, and that's ultra low. So let me give you an example. So right now in my office with our team of buyers, we have about 40 people that are just really want to buy a house. We only have 66 new homes came up on the market. So that is a very, very low inventory. So we're going to see this continue and, and prices are obviously up across the board. So low inventory theme. Now interest rates, you know, a little bit of a move. So if we went back 30, 60 days ago, rates were in the low threes for mortgages. Now they're in the higher threes. So that could continue with all the conversation about increasing rates this year. So it hasn't affected us yet, but it could. And then lastly, okay, this creates a situation I hear a lot. I'd like to move how we want to sell our house. We want to make the move, but there's nothing we want to buy. There's nothing out there. So how do we deal with this low inventory? Well, I have to tell you that it's different now than what conventionally people think about. Right now, the winners in this marketplace, unless they have the cash ready to go buy a house, are those that are putting their house up for sale and basically, for lack of a better term, making it contingent on finding another home. And this helps for several reasons. One, when you're selling your house, most of our owners had no idea how much their home was worth. So now they're getting more money than they thought from their home and it widens the choices they have. Two, most buyers are willing to wait. They just want to know they can buy your home. So it allows the seller to have time to go find another house. We have about four or five other ways to take care of this. But at the end of the day, unless you're a buyer that's ready to buy without getting that home sold right away, let's talk about putting that house on the market. There's so many benefits to those kind of homeowners and we've seen it time and time again. So if you are thinking of making this move, but scared because there's nothing available or know someone who is, call us immediately. We have other solutions and other ways to make sure we can make this a smooth transition. Last thing we're going to do is make you homeless. We'll make sure you can move into the next house. Our number is 805-781-3750. Thank you and have a great day.